So I'm going to be testing out the Tesla, but too bad, I don't have my, I didn't bring my wallet, man, my driver's license, man. Oh uh, yeah, sure do. Had somebody that was short in here before. So it's going to be pretty similar to what you might be used to just in a, you know, a traditional vehicle with four wheels, steering wheel. But when when you let up off the accelerator, this car, kind of like a golf cart, oh. slows down pretty quick. It right. has their regenerative braking. I think I drove electric. Well, uh, we did? But golf cart, though. A golf cart, though. Okay. <laughs> well, so the, the, way, the way it works is pretty similar, except uh, it's just scaled up. So we have a really large battery in the floor, and then a motor in the front, a motor in the rear. Um, this just has the two motors? Yeah, there's okay. there's never more than two motors on our cars. Except for the Roadster. The Roadster has three. No, there's still two. No, I mean, still the, only two. Yeah, the only one that would have it is the semi. Ah, okay. the Tesla semi has one in each wheel, one in each wheel. Ah, okay. Um, so as far as uh, the screen, the way it would work, we have a big backup camera here. This is the navigation, and if we zoom out in the navigation, you can see where all the chargers are. Oh, all right. over the country. Lot. So we have a ton of chargers. These are called superchargers. These charge your car up 50% uh, in about 20 minutes. So you guys have them all along the highways on every single. So 100%. Oh yeah. Uh, well, usually about an hour. So the the first half of the battery just charges quicker than the second half. Mm -hmm. So it just depends on where your battery is when you hop on the charger. But usually about 20% uh, or 50% in 20 minutes. But don't so. it charge like as you drive though too? It helps to recharge some of what's lost like through the yeah every... through the regenerative braking. Um, so the brake pads don't actually recharge it. It's actually the motor. Okay. So when you let off the accelerator and it starts slowing down, it feels to us it feels it. like you're hitting the brake pedal, but it's actually just the motor spinning in reverse, recapturing some of that. This is the P100D Model S. So chill is just very relaxed, kind of conservative acceleration. Sport is more uh, quick, just in zero to sixty. This one does zero to sixty in about four point one seconds. And ludicrous is awesome. <laughs> is is the fastest um, in terms of production sedan right now. So this goes 0 to 60 in about 2.28 seconds. Steering mode is just how comfortable or loose or loose or tight the steering wheel is. So we start off there on standard and then regenerative braking is what we had just talked about. Gotcha. Um, down here you have some of your controls for the climate and then this is where you get back to that menu here. As far as things you'll see on your screen there, you see the uh, miles per hour and your speedometer be here. Your range is in the bottom corner. And then in front of you, you'll see where everybody else is on the road once you actually start driving. Oh, wow. That's cool. How do you raise this up? Well, to I'm raise that up, you can make the adjustment with a little knob on the left. There's a little baby one back there. Yeah. So you can go up, down, uh, and go. you can go in and out as well. And then to adjust the mirrors, if you need to do that, the left side on the door, there's a control. You can choose yeah, the mirror maybe. first and then use the directional pad to change it. Works. You don't have to warm up the car or nothing? No. You just, it's just a heating element. That's so so the heating nice element it. just turns on in like just two minutes. It's all, is, was it coils that heat up? Or yeah, or heating okay. coils. Also, it can also use, can um, make we can make a right here. Make a right. Yeah, once we get to the light at the end, we'll make a left there. Um, it heats it up in two ways. Once you've actually been driving, it can take some of the, the glycol from the battery pack where it uses the glycol to heat and cool. It can use some of that residual heat to heat the cab and also it uses the electric heat as well. Okay. The highway and go ah, down okay. then we would be able to but it's only like we wouldn't be able to use it on this road gotcha um so you're supposed to not really use it on this road yeah definitely or the auto yeah autopilot the only reason we don't use it on a road like this is because it doesn't it's read the street stopping. well it doesn't it, the stop and go is actually fine it handles out really well but it doesn't read the street lights or the stop signs at least with this current software so if if you were to actually it would um, run a red light it yeah. would run a red light if nobody's in front of you no gear changes either. That's no, true. there's no transmission. <laughs> it, just, it just keeps going. There's no transmission. <laughs> right. That's awesome. How does it feel? 
It feels like a normal car. It's just, it's just a little different, but it feels like a normal car. You can, yeah, there you go. Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit! <laughs> I didn't even, I didn't even step on the gas all the way. Or it's, it's the pedal, or whatever it is. Oh, I just lost my stomach. <laughs> I didn't even step on it that hard. See, but I only went to 45. I Holy yeah, shit. you got to 45 really quick. That's not even ludicrous <laughs> mode. That's, that's, well, that's, that's, that's ludicrous. Yeah. Oh, that was. So this is yeah. Oh shit, that scared me. That was that is. Yeah, my seat I think I just off. shit myself. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, that's crazy. <laughs> oh my god. It's hard to get that same it? kind of. Time. I didn't even step on the gas all the way or pedal, whatever the hell it is. It's not gas. <laughs> oh my god. He's trying to hit a red light. I want. I'm waiting for a red light with nobody in front of me. There's nobody in front of you now. Yeah, but I want that light to turn red. Oh, you want to launch, huh? Yeah. Oh yeah. Just to. I really wanted to try. Well, we're gonna have to make another appointment. If you, we're, I'm, I'm really happy to schedule everybody again to come back again. I just want to make sure you guys have just a full time. Because we ran time. out of time, quick. William, it's tough. It's tough on the weekends. <laughs> it's tough on the weekends. So what's the what's the zero to sixty on the mo on the the Model Three? Um, so it's either it depends on the configuration. It's uh, five point four, four point five, or three point three, depending on which one you get. The performance Ooh. one is three point three. I like the 3.3. <laughs> That's still crazy fast. It's, it's nice to have. It's That's nice to crazy. have. I mean, you have it every day. And well, it this one was, what, 2 point something? 2.28. That's... Wow. I didn't even step on it all the way either. <laughs> and this is with five people in the car. Wow. So it's probably slowing it down. Probably. Hair. Yeah, a little bit. Well, you got to get one. You got to give Quick a run for his money. Yeah. This one is uh, ludicrous mode, which is the quickest production car. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Don't break too fast. It's like throwing you. Well, I it was 55. I went to 60. Actually, that one. This is faster than more, like two, three, four hundred thousand dollars sports cars. Yeah, this is quicker than a Ferrari. And you're paying a wow. million dollars plus. Yeah, I mean, when you when you look at it dollar for dollar, pound for pound, you get a lot more so out, of, money. out of a Tesla. But it depends what you're looking for. You know, a lot of people that do drive those performance cars, they don't necessarily get rid of them. But it's yeah. tough to drive something like that every day to work. This is just comfortable. If you're just going to and from the office and stuff, yeah. Oh, put, your, put your head back against the seat. Alright. Oh. <laughs> 55's gonna be here real quick. Thanks. Ah! <laughs> <laughs> oh, where'd everybody go? <laughs> it looks like they're still with the light. Oh my god! Oh! <laughs> <laughs> you put, that put, just has to put a smile on your face every time, every right? Every time. Yeah. Sometimes I close my eyes and it oh feels like I'm on a roller coaster. Gosh! <laughs> no, roller coasters don't even do that. No. Hey, as far as inspection goes, you gotta go through inspection with this? You still need a state, a state inspection, but it's not an emissions inspection, so it's like 10 bucks. Oh. Oh, oh shit. Even better. Yeah, it's saving you money on no, everything. There's no emissions, so... But Will, you were saying there's like, um, a, there's a, well, the charging station you put in your house. Oh, it's no. a, a wall connector. So you get uh, like a 240 volt line basically installed in your house. Oh, you gotta install that, eh? It's, most people do. You could use, use a 110. It all depends on very long, yeah, like days. days. Um, depending on how far you drive every day. So if you were to tell me you drive 10 miles a day, you could charge up overnight, no problem. <laughs> you notice the wheels don't slip at all. Nothing. No it's, wheel uh, slipping. The traction control is very strong. <laughs> and I don't wanna be so without you. Oh, pretty good.